He's out. This is Red Kite Alert 3, a magfed only game hosted by Red Alert Paintball and Airsoft and run by OMG Events. I've been tasked with leading a small sniper team into the dense and unforgiving woodland in order to secure an overwatch position. The bomb now en route, we may well be the last line of defense. The initial plan is to try finding the bomb before it reaches the village outskirts, but having never played here before, it's proving a challenge. In this video I'm using my custom rusted Planet Eclipse EMF 100 equipped with the rifled S63 barrel system, CF20 magazines and firing first strike. We're slowly moving deeper into this woodland, silent, precise, and undetected. The Blackthorns don't expect us this far out of the way, making our positioning all the more important. Missing the target frustrates me to no end, but not so much when fellow sniper Scott makes up for my mistake. <laughs> that sounded amazing. It's becoming apparent that the news of snipers in the woods is very much a threat, and more and more blues want to give us some attention. I feel enough damage has been done from this location, so time to push forward and find where the sound of gunfire is coming from. That black walled building is the objective compound, signaling our position behind enemy lines. I'm trying to pick off the straggling defenders as accurately as possible, as to not give my position away. Can you see him? Very well, on the back of the... Yes, I can. Oh, I right, will, that's how I want to. Drop it. Good man. <laughs> I may try getting a bit closer, actually, yeah, yeah. so I can see a bit more of the left. That player was holding the last fuel rod to activate the bomb. It must be close. What? 
with the surrounding woodland now clear, and the Blackthorns having the embassy locked up. The bomb is a four-mine carry, but if it reaches the compound, our mission has failed. Scott and myself have set up positions overlooking the objective entrance. The compound is fully under blue control, and the bomb's location is mere meters away. They're almost to the compound now. We have both blues and reds spread throughout the village, so I'm using the confusion to remain hidden. Scott, have you got eyes on the bomb? Oh, I do. That failed attempt edging the bomb ever closer. I'm not fancying my chances right here. Some divine intervention right there. Oh, hurt, hurt, hurt. you very much to everybody who watched the video i really enjoyed making this one it was probably one of my better events the site at red alert really really spoke to my inner madness soul if you will both the layout the the look the feel just an incredible woodland space and what barney and the team have done over in red alert is just astounding and it's just you know i've always been a fan of woodland sites but red alert is is by far one of my favorite woodland sites in the UK I've ever been to. I cannot wait to go again as paintball sites go. Oh, it's hard to beat. So yeah, really, really enjoyable game. I, I, I was able to channel my inner DMR style of gameplay with fellow red team member Scott, who uh, with his Hammer 7 just was a beast and always had my back. And yeah, pleasure working in a, in a team of snipers. It was awesome awesome and i hope that came across in the video quick apology for the uh kind of entire year it took to make this video almost a lot of, lots going on in my life at the moment and unfortunately that hasn't left a lot of room for editing and paintballing i've still been trying to play as much as i humanly possibly can but hopefully going forward i will try and i don't know i'll try and get back onto form i i I'm I'm not one for sticking to schedules. You know, I'm happy to put content out when when I really want to make a video because if I'm forced to make a video, it's not going to be a great video for you. So every video I like to think comes from the heart, just a little bit. And I'm afraid that's all I got for you. I appreciate every single one of you for watching my videos. Um, I know. It takes a long time in between each video, so I do hope that you enjoy and savour each one. And I think we just, yeah, I think we just need to appreciate each other, um, be kind to each other. Just enjoy being surrounded by like-minded paintballers, non-paintballers, airsofters, you know. We're all shooting each other for fun. It's an amazing sport. They're both, both airsoft and paintballers are both amazing sports. And... You know, meeting the greatest people in the world while getting to go at it, really. It's it's just, yeah. It's amazing, and I love it. And I love you all, as always. So, until the next video, toodaloo.